Hey everyone, thanks for joining me for another What's Trending Trevor. I'm your guy Trevor Pale, and right now I have some of the sports videos that are buzzing on the web. Now in the NBA, they say you need eight tenths of a second to get off a shot, a quick shot. While Trevor Booker of the Utah Jazz was faced with a much more difficult task. There was only two tenths of a second on the clock and realistically, there's nothing you can do but check it out. As the ball is inbounded, Booker quickly taps the ball over his head and it goes in. That has to go down as one of the craziest circus shots the NBA has ever witnessed. His back is completed to the basket and he hits the ball quickly like a volleyball pack. Even he had a smile about it. The craziest part to me is that it looks like he has done this before. Sometimes size doesn't matter over your toughness. Here's Kevin Garnett and Dwight Howard getting into it. After some pushing, we get some contact when KG comes in with some sort of a headbutt and Howard at first appeared to throw a punch, but it was really an open hand half given slap. Earlier this season, Howard was called soft by Kobe Bryant and clearly here KG looks fired up and ready to throw some hands, but Howard is just calm. Now, of course, I wouldn't want either one of these guys coming after me, but if anything, I would put my money on Kevin Garnett. Speaking of hands, this basketball player has some great ones. Not the one shooting the free throw either. As the free throw is missed, you can see a fan on the court. He looks to push a player or try to get out of his way, and one of his teammates comes in with the punch. Now, even after the hit, you can see players pushing the player back as if they didn't want him hitting their fans. As a personal fan of sports, I don't care for the antics of people needing to run on the field or any play at venue. I personally thought this was one good way to handle things. That's going to wrap up What's Trading Trevor. Be sure to follow me on Twitter at TrevorPillETFS and check out ETFinalScore.com for instant sports updates.